Yeah, it's time for interactive. Follow us on Twitter at Sportsmax Zone for Instagram and YouTube. Our handle is Sportsmax TV Live. Watch, like, comment, and share, and we'll react to your questions and comments during the show. It's time to see the nominations for this week's Sportsmax Class Moment. Around Muyamba. Dixon Arroyo. Yedlin coming forward. Arroyo will take it himself. It's off the crossbar. Campana there. Oh, Campana! What a goal! As they have done so often, Inter Miami striking first with just the one chance. This ball recycles. Great run from Yedlin that pulls Wiley away. Step into it. Great hit has the goalkeeper beat. How is that for a touch over Miles Robinson? Calm, cool, collected with all the pressure in the world around you. A hectic moment. How's that for two touches with the... Goes up the body again, and the feeders are just a mere spectator. This young man is a different time of the cricket ball, 18 for nine. Yeah, just a, a flick of the wrist, really. Might even have been a leading edge, I'm not too sure. You know, the face of the bat. Really good timing from Saeem Ayub. one of the leaders of the team, that's for sure. Well, yeah. Yeah. He led from the front. There's Brown trying to lead from the front himself. Inside the box, Brown. Brown. Still Brown. Magnificent. Oh, that's world class. It really was. You want these youngsters to show the skill, but with the skill, the finish. And he'll never replicate that again. Insanely good! And Kingston College with a total advantage! What a way to score your first goal of the season, Kelvin Brown. Had been causing problems on the right hand side. For the duration of the second half so far. Just a look at this. Walls in pass. The camp without defenders. Thought it was a heavy touch. Oh, just rose it past. Good intuition as well by Brown. And then the topo pass class. Who certainly was beaten for peace. KC, 2-0 to the good. Lance Whitaker, this is by far the hardest week in a long, long time. It Those is. were three, as far as I'm concerned, genuinely class moments. Yes. When you think about the word class, you look at any of those moments and you see absolute class mm. and now we have the toughest decision we've had to make in a long time so lance i'll allow you to go first while i think you know, about it first let me just register that i agree with you 100 percent that all three are winners yes you know on on a on a different day they each could have won on their own merit but I, it's, it's going to be hard for me to deny campana the first goal from the inter miami you know that was well the shot the rocket of a shot that crashed onto the bar by itself was a thunderous strike, but the composure and confidence and style of Campana's finish, I would I would just give that the edge. But it was it's, it's a close call, you know. I mean, there were two defenders in his vicinity as the rebound came to him here. Oh, that looked superb. I'd give that the edge, Ricardo. I'd give that the edge, but it's close. Yeah, that looks classy. That really does look classy. And, and most Inter-Miami class moments now come from Messi. Yeah. And this one comes from Leonardo Campana. Yeah. I, I'm going to go with Kelvin Brown, though. Yeah. The, the, the Kingston College player. Um, beating, I think, two, three players. Uh -huh. Having picked the ball up. Yeah. Um, and then the finish as well. The, yeah. the, the finish for me is where the real class is because at that level, especially at the high school level, yes. when he gets into that position, you're almost expecting him to go for power. 
and that little chip away from the goalkeeper in my opinion is oh that's just real classy and I don't yeah. think the goalkeeper expected that either yeah um, so he what beat a number of defenders and then outsmarted the goalkeeper in my opinion yeah and, and I'm not sure if he's adept at using his left foot yeah. because there must have been a temptation for him to strike that ball left-footed yeah. but the ball was running across him and maybe if he had waited the defender advancing would have cut things off so that triggered his decision to just kick quickly with the right boot yeah. which to me was very very good thinking so um, on that score I, I agree that he gets some extra marks for that and by the way that six was a genuinely classy shot as well from Ayub yeah, Th that's real class. That's not an easy shot to play. R it looks R easy. Ricardo, we said it. This, <laughs> the, it was difficult to choose between the three because that was just a wrist. Yeah, that was just a wrist, and the ball flew to the mid-wicket boundary. So, yeah, we see it a lot from yeah um, Asian batsmen. Yeah, and and this Pakistani. Yeah, I mean, just just a fantastic shot in yeah. my opinion. Yeah. Well, the, the, we do have a fourth-class moment to present, Ricardo. You do? Yes, and, and it, it has to do with the appearance of one Monique Williams, who, who will present a birthday cake to you because <laughs> your birthday is Sunday, which, which is not a day that the Sports Max Zone is on. And um, I think you should feel really honored that this lovely young lady is presenting this delicious-looking cake well, to well, you. Well, first of all, right? First of all, <laughs> th there's no need to look at the cake. Can I get a hug? Can I... Can I Oh. <laughs> oh my word. Oh, thank you so much. Happy birthday oh. on Sunday, Ricardo. No, no, you could not have brought a better person to present the we, cake. We know Hold that. on, where is she going? Isn't she going to cut and, and feed me like Mariah no. did for Lance? <laughs> or, or do we wait until Sunday? <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're not an hero on Sunday. Um, commiserations, commiserations though, Chapo, because you've missed being a Virgo by a couple of days. Still September, so you, you get some you get some stripes for that. But you're a couple of days late of being a Virgo, so commiserations. I, I'm not a big sign guy, you know. <laughs> I am I, I am I am September. Yeah. I am a lover of life. Yes. I am life <laughs> wherever I am. <laughs> um, and you know what I, I'm planning to do on Sunday Lance? Tell me. Um, I probably shouldn't say this, but I'm currently playing a tennis tournament. It was supposed to end on Saturday, which was tomorrow. Because of the weather, it's been pushed back to Sunday. The finish has been pushed back to Sunday. I'm in two semifinals, mixed doubles with the great Bridget Foster Hilton, Whoa. world champion, 100 hurdles in 2009, yes. and singles. And I have both semifinals tomorrow. Yes. And I hope I'll be in both finals and have both trophies on yeah. Sunday. Okay, well, we, we'll see what happens there. Um, enjoy your day, Sunday, Chapo. Oh, I will. And I hope, that, I hope that the, net, the tennis goes well for you as well. Um, we've got to run because coming up now, qualifier two of the Republic Bank CPL, the Talawas taking on the Amazon Warriors. Who will win? The winner goes through to the final Sunday against TKR. We'll see you Monday.